What really happened between Jay-Z and Dame Dash? Jay's my best friend. Oh. I'm not ashamed to say it. The two were once close friends and like-minded entrepreneurs willing to put in the work to achieve success. Raise your glasses, your glasses, your glasses. Want to make toast? May your glasses stay full of champagne, pockets full of money, this world is full of However, today they're publicly battling over the record label they spent years building. If you do want to buy one third of Rockefeller Inc., I'm going to sweeten the pot. You get an original Rockefeller chain from off my neck. We know what we've seen publicly, but it makes you wonder what really happened behind the scenes. You know, we all know that Jay-Z personifies this, which is why he's actually the franchise right now. And the label is built around him, and Hello. for now. You know. Okay, so make another hole. We all know Dame was an ass. So we parted ways like Ben and J Lo. But is that enough to force the sale of a legendary New York record label to a Canadian or California artist? And then a toast to Rockefeller.